Hello everyone, I am Kaushik. I am CEO of Vishnu Foundation TBI and Director for Innovation and Entrepreneurship at Sri Vishnu Educational Society. Today I am going to uh, introduce to a program called BUILD, uh, which is supported by uh, ITIC, IIT Hyderabad. Uh, BUILD stands for Bold and Unique Idea Lead Development Program. Uh, this uh, IIT Hyderabad, IT IIT Hyderabad and Greenco group, uh, they have collaboratively introduced this program to support student ideas. Because if you see uh, the if you see the entrepreneurship ecosystem, uh, all the investments are funding are given to startups. But there are student innovators also who have ideas which can solve so many community problems. So to support student ideas IT, iit hyderabad and green co have collaborated and they have again collaborated with 14 incubator from uh, throughout country and uh, they have come out this build program to support exclusively student innovators and vishnu foundation is proud partner uh, of this build program so today we are going to uh, discuss about how to apply for this bill program to get uh, to get funding uh, of up to 1 lakh rupees and at the same time mentoring support from iit hyderabad as well as vishnu foundation tbi this will be great opportunity for the students who have ideas to solve any community or any problem in the society so uh, it's very simple uh, uh, 14 incubators are uh, tied up with the uh, with IIT Hyderabad to support these uh, innovations. Uh, in this uh, year, 75 innovators will be supported uh, with a financial aid of up to 1 lakh rupees. And at the same time, you will be getting mentorship from the mentors of all sectors. Uh, so who are, I mean, program structure is very uh, simple. Uh, it is 12 months program. Uh, uh, in the first uh, first tranche will be released in first six months if your idea is good if you are progressing well second tranche also will be re released in the next six months the whole program is for 12 months right and you will be uh, allocated one tbi primary tb uh, primary uh, incubator will be iit hyderabad itic iit hyderabad and secondary incubator and third uh, third incubator will be uh, what you choose in this case, you will be choosing Vishnu Foundation TBI uh, uh, so that, uh, so that uh, we will be supporting you uh, uh, with your innovation. So the selection process is sim very simple. Uh, you'll, uh, I'll be showing you the application form. You will fill that and then uh, it will come to the incubators and we will be selecting the best innovations. So benefits uh, for the selected innovators will be access to network of mentors opportunities to seek financial funding and support, access to the facilities of IT incubator, prototyping support, IP fi IPR filing support. IPR filing means intellectual property uh, filing where you can file your patent or design patent or trademark or anything, copyright or anything. And then you'll be getting co-working space in the primary incubator or secondary incubator to sit and work on your idea. The eligibility criteria are as follows. An innovator must be an Indian citizen. Innovator, innovator must be from UG students or recent graduates. An individual innovator or team can also apply. You can apply individually or you, 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 sh you should have a team uh, who will be working on this innovation. Uh, we always prefer to have a team uh, because uh, multiple uh, minds will think about the idea and then you can come out with very good idea. And innovation should contribute towards either development or improvement of any product. Uh, any product or process in existing or new fields or should be scalable business model with potential to generate employment or wealth creation so deadline to apply is july 5th and uh, here there is the supply now button you click on this you will be directed to this google form uh, all the details are here you have to fill are you applying as a team or idea you just you just have to fill individual or team Full name of the primary applicant, you have to give your full name, email ID, mobile number, current status of the applicant, are you undergraduate or completed graduation in last 12 months, 
uh, recent graduates also will have the opportunity. And if you are other, you please fill the other. Upload the proof of the status of undergraduate student or recent graduate. You have to upload your college ID uh, uh, so that uh, we'll understand your undergraduate or recent graduate. Uh, this opportunity is only for undergraduates and recent graduates only, right? So with this, we'll get to know who are you. And then brief description of idea, highlighting innovative elements. You have to uh, write your uh, about your idea, not more than 50 words. And uh, final expected outcomes and deliverables you can fill here. Uh, who would be your beneficiary? Uh, who would be the beneficiary of this innovation? And why do they need it? Because whenever you do any innovation, you should keep who is your customer in mind and who is your beneficiary? Who will get benefited with your innovation? You should mention here. And then there is a pitch deck. Uh, if you click on this, you will be uh, guided to a pitch deck. Uh, I'll explain you uh, how to fill that pitch deck also with an example and you have to fill that and upload here and then your preferred incubator for support preference one is obviously IT incubator at IIT Hyderabad preferred incubator for support uh, you have a list of support here uh, yeah we prefer you to select Vishnu Foundation TBI and preference three also you can select Vishnu Foundation TBI or any one of the incubator but the preference will be Vishnu Foundation because you all are uh, associated with Vishnu Foundation and you can get the support in your college only and then submit. So now let us go to uh, the pitch deck here, uh, which I have opened already. So if you go to uh, this pitch deck, they have given list of uh, uh, rules, uh, what to follow in the pitch deck. You have to delete after you read, I mean, before you submit. But one one important thing which you need to uh, follow is this. Whenever you are submitting, whenever you are submitting your pitch deck, uh, you should save your file with founder name. Suppose uh, my name is Kaushik, so I'll write Kaushik hyphen pitch deck for build. That should be your file name. And once you fill this pitch deck, you have to upload in the Google form, right? Let's go to the next slide. So uh, your company name or brand name. See, uh, you might be working on uh, any electronic junk or any waste management uh, idea. Let us take this as an example and uh, let us go through the pitch deck. So you need to explain your brand name or your company name. As a student, you don't have any company name, but come out with some innovative name, your team name or brand name for the idea and then put here. Add a one-liner pitch below the company name. It should tell what your startup is about in one line. If you are working with waste management, the one-liner should be waste to wealth or waste management for sustainable communities or sustainable societies. That should be your line. Mention your college name and city. You should main, uh, mention who, uh, what's your college name and in which city that is. Coming to the second slide, what is the problem? As the example is about waste management, you should explain uh, the pain or problem of the beneficiary and customer along with how the customer is addressing the problem currently. Suppose you have waste uh, at your place, plastic waste. Let's take, a, let's take plastic waste as an example. If you see at any, at your home, at your college or at uh, anywhere you go, plastic waste, waste is evident. So that's the problem for all the customers. You need to do some Google survey about how much plastic waste is generated in your city, in your uh, in your state, and in India and in, uh, and throughout world. If you bring these statistics, and if you also bring the statistics how people are tackling this plastic waste currently, because all the plastic waste is going to dump, or it is going into oceans, and marine life is getting affected. So these kind of statistics you need to bring in the slide. People are not tackling it well. People are throwing this plastic waste into the oceans or into the uh, dump yards and that is not getting degraded. So you have to uh, uh, shout out at the problem and at the same time how customers are tackling now, right? This should uh, come in, in the slide. Coming to the solution, now this plastic waste is there. How are you going to solve this plastic waste? How are you coming up with some idea? Suppose you come up with uh, some software uh, uh, app where 
any any customer or any household or any company who are working with plastic they'll come up to your web platform or a mobile app platform they'll upload about the plastic waste what they have and how many cages they have and they want to uh, uh, seek your help you come with your vehicle take that uh, plastic waste and go to your uh, unit and you process that waste and then you come out with some recycling material out of it so that should be your solution i'm just giving my example uh, you can include your blockchain so that transparency is there you can track the waste where is it going and how is it getting processed that is one idea you can always have your ai ml algorithms so that you can predict how much waste a company can generate all these things you can bring out as your solution and uh, uh, you can propose as well right this should be your solution coming to product or service as i told in the previous uh, slide it is your service and if you are uh, making some products out of the plastic waste you should mention there share your company uh, share how your company will be providing the solution in the form of products or service share images of product or service along with specification website link if any as a student innovator you might not be having any website link don't bother about it but at least you provide what kind of solution and how it looks like suppose if any innovator is applying already you are a student with startup if you have some website link please provide it and the specifications also then what is the market opportunity and target market mention the market size of your product as i already told you should see how much plastic is coming out from the households how much plastic is coming out from the uh, industries uh, from the from the companies you have to bring the statistics here that becomes your market opportunity and they are your target market okay describe the customer profile customer profile can be households customer profile can be companies who are working with plastic industries who are working with plastic you have to bring uh, those important statistics and you have to visually represent that uh, one more tip while you are making this pitch deck is don't put paragraphs and paragraphs here as much as possible in pointers you indicate everything and at the same time visually it should be competitive landscape please mention your direct and indirect competition i'll tell you uh, one company which i know the company uh, who are working on plastic waste management is recycle you can also google about them r e c y k uh, uh, r e c y k l this is one company who are working in plastic management with app and all so you should mention about them likewise you have to do some secondary research and uh, get who are your direct or indirect competitors who are working in this line and describe how your innovation differentiates you from your competitor because you have to bring out some innovative idea right you have to mention your competitor and at the same time what is how are you different from that competition has to come in this slide then revenue model as a company how do you generate revenue out of your innovative idea you have to many, mention here it can be subscription model it can be like 10 kg of plastic they are giving you charge something from them and then if after you recycle that comes out as uh, some recycled product how are you selling those recycled products again it it should generate revenue whatever innovation you are talking about it should generate some revenue that is what you have to mention here and at the same time those revenues you have to uh, mention clearly is it through subscription model is it through some uh, buying the waste uh, or selling the waste you have to bring out this in this particular slide and then future road map and support what are your next steps because this project is for 12 months you have to clearly mention month by month how are you going to uh, bring out your innovation and what are your goals and what are your milestones this should be very clear based on this only your selection will be done other than funding as i told you will be getting 1 lakh funding support and at the same time all the uh, other supports also if you need some other support suppose if you take this idea only you want to connect with some idea uh, uh, some industries you have to mention here who are generating plastic this is just an example you can come out with whatever uh, ideas you have so this you need to clearly mention here so that we understand while we select whether we can support and how can we support in this 
and then the last slide is who are your team members what are your achievements so far you might have uh, participated in some idea thons or hackathons and uh, you might have won some things uh, some ideas also at uh, that on all you have to mention here that uh, that says us how capable are you to solve this problem and at the same time you have to tell your qualification details first year second year your department uh, and your photographs also you have to include and at the same time list of advisors if any you can include your mentors uh, your faculty or whoever it is you can include your advisors also if you have any this becomes your uh, team slide and then contact details your email ids founders email ids phone numbers and city this ends your uh, pitch deck so uh, students uh, uh, this is uh, this is your uh, how you have to prepare your pitch deck right uh, uh, with this uh, if you have any uh, if you have any uh, uh, support required you can always uh, contact uh, vishnu foundation tbi um, you all know uh, uh, our contact details also you can go to vishwa.co and you will find the uh, details of us please reach out to me uh, for any problem uh, so that i can help this video will definitely help you uh, thank you very much uh, please avail this opportunity so that you can uh, you can uh, work on your product when you are doing your uh, studies and at the same time you can start your company once you start your company that definitely helps in creating jobs this should be your motto right thank you very much